I'm excited to carry on playing some Pokemon DLC. So let's wake up the controller. Hello? Controller? Hi. Good morning. Press the button, please. There we go. Nailed it. Now let's get back into Kitakami. A decently long stream today, I think. At least like five hours. Shiny Puchiana and Yanma completely randomly. Let's go. I'm I'm yet to see a shiny for myself. As Callum was saying, got one yet? <laughs> no, because I'm not hunting for one. Just playing. <laughs> Alright, so last time we made it here to Kitakami Hall, and Kieran wants us to go to the the den. Crash my laptop. Oh no! Oh, what, your spreadsheet? My first and second time seeing- wait! So those, those are your first ever just random shinies in the wild driven? That's kind of cool. As a DLC so far, a lot of what you expect from me playing in the new Pokemon game, Ramen. Finding a Pokemon I've not seen in a while and going, Oh, Yanma! Oh, Mianxiao! So yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it's, um, the new area is cool. It's got the same graphical look and fidelity as, you know, Paldea, which is obvious, but... But, you know what they did fix, Ramen? Look at this. Look at this, Ramen. What do you notice in my boxes? Other than they're empty. What do you notice, Ramen? Oh, exactly. It's so fast! <laughs> Look at their loading speed. It took them ten months to fix it. Game finally out of open beta. Oh, dear. But yeah, we've just been running around, like, just catching the Pokemon that are new to the region. And just, uh, seeing what goodies we can collect. Dunsparce? <gasps> Timber! Did we already catch Timber? I forget. Hi, Bagtrian! How you doing? I don't think we did catch Timber. Oh, that's cool. She's going down. We're yelling, Timber! All right, let's catch this little guy. Grab your ball. Kept making that sound before it went down, worried it won't work again. That is bizarre. How you doing, Bactrian? Did you have a chance to uh, test out any of your Pokemon ideas? Dude, Conkledo is kind of a cool Pokemon. Gen 5 was a really good Pokemon, like, generation for uh, fighting types. I kind of want to use Conkledur, but I've got Mianxiao. Love the Oka Fit vibes. So excited for Autumn. Thank you, it's more yellow, but... <laughs> uh, always carrying squared logs, they help out with construction. As they grow, they carry bigger logs. Hey, Raman, what should we call this guy? I've been doing a thing where I've just been yelling out people's names in chat and telling them to nickname this Pokemon for me. Hardwood. <laughs> Alright, let me get my keyboard. <laughs> Is it gonna let me do that? I don't think so, Tokyo-chan, no. I don't think so at all. Um, hardwood. It did let me do that. Well, I'll be. Wait, Woodchucker? I can rename it, don't worry. Are you sure? Are you sure you want it to be called Woodchucker? Bim to Bim. I can rename it, don't worry, Ramen. I can rename it. Wait, this thing gets guts? Does Conkledur get guts? What chucker? There you go. All right, what else we got around here? More timbers. We got Hatena. 
This is actually kind of good. If this is like a, a bigger spawn location for Hatena, it might be kind of nice. Hey, Sparky, what up? How we doing? I thought that Hatena spawned around ponds and lakes. I also heard the outbreak forms now actually function properly. Do I have an outbreak? Good you? Yeah, I'm pretty good, thanks. Pretty good. I got a Shinx outbreak. At least I got an outbreak here. And Barboach. Ooh. I want to see if I got a Pokemon over in Paldea that has a form. I don't think I do. That's a negative. That's fine. That's a gutsy guy. Just got Magikarp in the river. That's Aracuda. I thought for a second that might have been Remoraid. That would be a cool Pokemon to add. Remoraid. And Octillery. We got some Bonsly. Nothing else here that seems newish though. I guess we could open up the map. And that would sort of give you a glimpse to who could be around. Alright, let's go talk to Kieran. Oh, that's a trainer. Um, you know what? We've had Jan Mega uh, in the spotlight for a while now. Let's get Mian Xiao. I want to use Mian Xiao. Ramulad. <laughs> Oh dear. So this thing... Okay, high jump kick, aura sphere, bounce, and calm mind. Let's see if we can get a better fighting move. Drain punch, force palm, might be kind of good. Maybe not. We'll go for drain punch instead of uh, aura sphere. You seen what Pokemon are all in the DLC that were in the main game? No. I've not looked at what Pokemon are in the DLC. The only Pokemon I know that are in the DLC area are the Pokemon that I've seen. Ooh, Home Claws? Love that you can swap learn moves? Yeah. Oh, I can learn Fake Out as well. Damn, that's pretty good. What about, um... What about TMs? They've also added a new thing with TMs, Ramen, in this game. In, in this update. You can learn Close Combat? Oh. Stone Edge? You can learn Ice Spinner? That's a pretty good one. Was jab grass not? Um, yeah, they've they've added a filter button when you go to the T. You know the the TM machine when you uh when you craft TMs. So to kind of explain how it's going to be useful in this area here, where you go use TMs to learn move, it will filter it down with all of the TMs that Mian Xiao can learn, but only the ones that we currently have. Like if there's ones that we can craft, but we don't have the materials for it, it won't show up in this list. So it now shows up in a list when you go to craft them of all the TMs that a Pokemon can learn. Which I think is, it should have been like that from the start. It's really useful. Wanted to ask before I told you something my friend told me. Not sure uh, how true it is though as I haven't seen myself. Right. Well, keep it in the back of your mind. Maybe make a, a note of it. And <laughs> we'll see if we come across it. No more endless sifting, yeah. Oh, hi, Bonsly. <gasps> Mian Shao! Oh, I love this Pokemon so much. So I've heard apparently. Uh, don't do that. Um, if you send a Pokemon out and then you whistle, it stops them. And then they just pause there. And that's when you can, like, get your camera out. Yo, Hylian! Thank you for the raid! Welcome, Raiders. We're just checking out the DLC. I know you're on vacation, so you're probably going to raid and run. Uh, but thank you for the raid. Appreciate it. Welcome, Raiders. Hope you enjoyed the direct. I'm pretty sure that, like, Thousand Year Door was the highlight of a lot of people. 
Now I can actually get a good pitch from my Pokemon. Yeah. You could play music as well, and they'll do, like, endless posing. You can make him snooze. Thousand Years uh, Door, definitely my highlight. I don't know what my highlight was. Probably that trumpet game. <laughs> trumpet game looked pretty good. You need a shiny of Mianxiao because it's Pank. I know. <laughs> oh, we should probably get our spoilers up. I forgot about that today. Uh, chat, I don't know what Pokemon are in the DLC other than the, obviously the ones that I've seen. So please, um, unless you've like seen us encounter these Pokemon, you know, I, I'd prefer if you didn't like, you know, say, Oh my god! Atena's in the DLC, did you see? Dude, F0 <laughs> F zero ninety nine. When they showed F0, I was like, no. No way. Are they actually giving us a new F0 game? And it ended up being a battle royale. <laughs> Nintendo knows what Nintendo fans want. And then they just crap all over it. <laughs> when you come to the mountains, you can only do two things. What? I actually died. Hey, Nug, how's it going? What's up, Rachel Green Tea? Late from the raid, but hi. No worries. Hello. Geeky Ray, what's up? Oh! Interesting. They're giving us Alolan Sandshrew now. Now, I know that we've seen Sandshrew and Sandslash, but I haven't seen Alolan Sandshrew and Sandslash. Sands Blue? The ultimate bait and switch? Yeah, and a Vulpix. Is this going to be Alolan Vulpix as well? It is. Let's go get snapped up by Mianxiao. Leaving because of spoilers, uh, and my husband plays. No worries, Bookie. Appreciate it. Thank you for stopping in. I completely understand the, uh, the spoiler avoidance. Wait, Hylian, you got the golden... Wait, did you guys get the golden Kappa train? No! Or did you get it from... So I think uh, Simcopter had one today, didn't he? Do you guys get the Golden Kappa? May or may not have squealed. We did get one, it was dope! Oh, I'm jealous, man. Congratulations on your Golden Kappas, everybody. How long have you got them for? Does it say, is it 24 hours? We got a shiny! Hello, Cozy. Oh, Cozy. After all this time, finally a DK game, am I right? 24 hours? Yeah, finally. You gonna be, uh, you gonna be getting it? I was a little sad when I realized it was just a remake, honestly. I guess we're just kind of in that territory now, aren't we? Just remake territory. A little taste of one, yeah. It's not even a Donkey Kong game, is it? It's just still a Mario game. This area is cool. I like this area. Have I? How many Geodudes have I already got? Zero. Okay. Well, let's get ourselves some Geodude. So, Raiders, what I've been doing is I've just randomly been picking someone out in chat and just calling upon them to nickname um, the Pokemon as I get them. This thing better not explode on me. Take a sip every time Mario shown, hurdle pension. Name thy rock. It's at random. How's it going, buddy? Do you want to name my Geodude? If not, it's totally cool. I understand. But I'm just, I'm just calling out random people in chat. Uh, lurkers can still lurk, you know, I'm not gonna call out lurkers. Just if I see your name. <laughs> yeah, you random. Arrest, it looks just like a rock. Kelsey stepping on it will make it swing its fists angrily. How about Rocky? Perfect. Hey, yo, Adrian. I also noticed, um, the DLC Pokedex. The Pokemon that you've already registered, say like, um... Raichu and Pikachu, 
They have new, um... They have new, um... Cover art. I think. Yeah, like the Pichu. Look at that Pichu, it's adorable. It's completely different from the Paldean Pokedex picture. Lurkers can lurk, haters can hate, lovers can love, exactly. Exactly. Yeah, like, uh, Staraptor. Pretty cool. Is that molded sandwich? I thought you had a different use. I, I'm so <laughs> Molded in his 18 or 19 different accounts. God damn it. <laughs> Nomers can nom. Is that why some Pokemon from the Pokedex uh, don't have their pictures on the sides there? Um, what do you mean, Pastel? Happy for you, Bactrian. At least one of us is happy. Wait, why is Bactrian happy? I don't even like Ramelade Sauce. I just named Ramelade that because when I first saw it, my stupid dyslexic brain called it that. Um, I used to call Octillery Octolily. Lost my access discount for a week or so. Don't judge. I'm not judging. I'm not judging. I'm just confused. I'm just slow. It's hard to keep up sometimes. I, do, I don't do well with change. We got a Noibat that's protecting this bridge. Excuse me, sir. Coming coming through, thank you. Yeah, new Prince of Persia looked kind of fun actually. Didn't have the little picture anymore on their tab. Oh, I've seen a I saw a bug when when I was registering Pokemon in the Pokedex, you know the animation where it spins round and the book goes in? I saw that sometimes some of the Pokemon icons were missing during that. Yeah, okay, Pastel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, Neo. Chimecho. <laughs> hey, look, I, I'm sorry. I, it never just clicked with me as a kid that it was meant to be uh, Chimecho. It wasn't until... You know, I heard it in the anime. I was like, oh, that makes sense. Loot. Lots of moonstones here. And a rare bone. Are we about to see a Q-bone? This area is kind of... Oh, there's trees up there. This area is kind of cool. Bonsley? Is it Bonsley or is it Bonsly? I just think it's meant to be pronounced like Bonsai. The anime calls our canine wrong. They do? Or do they call it Arcanine? Hey, well, I mean, if that's how the anime pronounces it, that's how I'm going to pronounce it from now on. It's definitely Arcanine. It's a canine? Well... I see where you're coming from, but... Trying to think of an example where the root word isn't the same as when so when something has a root word but it's not pronounced the same as the root word. Reggie ice. Oh, that one's annoying. Is it Reggie ice or is it Reg ice? Because I still call it Reggie ice, but I know there's only one eye in there, so it's definitely Reg ice. But then you can't have Reggie Rock, Reggie Lecky, Reggie Drago, Reggie Steel, Reggie Gigas, and then Reg ice. That's just not on. Oh, should we go have a good look at the uh, town down below? That's where we were. That's where the apple fields were. The rice paddies. Town. They do that in the English one as well. Um, at some point it was Arceus. At some other point it was Arceus. They can't make their mind up. That's my head cannon. For me, it's like 20 years of calling it Reggie Ice. But going back on that is very difficult for me to do. Bonsley? Bonsley. Interesting. Pronounce them all with emphasized Reg. So Reg, Iraq. 
Registeel. Reginald. Simply call him Reginald Ice. There you go. We'll call him Dr. Freeze. How about that? But at the end of the day, these are made up words for made up things in a made up world. Does it really matter how we pronounce them? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> potato, potato, tomato, tomato doesn't make much of a point in <laughs> text. Is that Clefairy? Huh, <gasps> Clefairy! Okay. That would be a fun one to shiny hunt. Shiny Clefairies are fun. I like the whole line, they just got green ears. Pachirisu is not made up. Uh, I've got bad news for you, Bactrian. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ow! Uh, this could be a problem. Please catch, please catch, please catch. Healing Wish? Oh. Do you reckon I could smack it with a Drain Punch? That won't do too much, will it? That won't be very effective. And then... We can just use another Heal Ball. Hey, Mama Snow! It chose violence. I'm good, thanks, Mama Snow. How are you? Guys, I heard on the on the grapevine that we might be having a little bit of a uh, a patch to download on the old uh, you know Palea today. I think. Don't quote me on it. On nights with a full moon, Clefairy gather from all over and dance, bathing in moonlight makes them float. Mama Snow, what should we call this Clefairy? <laughs> grapevine. Palea added grapes. <laughs> No more furry gardens. I don't know what's going to be included. I hope it's a fix to the flowstone issue. But I think they said that they were planning an update for today. I was expecting it before tomorrow. I thought they'd do it at some point this week. Fred. <laughs> we're going to call her Fred. <laughs> Third? Okay. Well, I can't spell, so it's called Third. Yeah, look, there's the masquerade and the bronze. On. Yeah, sometimes the icons just don't load properly. Bloob! Bloob is evolving! Good job, Bloob. That's your third Clefairy. <laughs> it's my, only my first one, actually. Clefairy. Alright, Bloob, I believe, was the one we were going to evolve all the way up to Polyrath. Hey, Mare's Dragon. How's it going? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Also, for those joining uh, that weren't here yesterday, I am playing through this DLC with, like, none of my original team. I had a Skeledurge on me to begin with to, uh, to catch some initial Pokemons. Type at you back tune that'll have to do. Wait, am I missing back am I missing ramen talk? Bloob is gonna be Polyrath because you said it'd be funny to see a Polyrath with that name. Yes. Although it's skilled in uh, in a style of dynamic swimming that uses all its muscles, for some reason it lives on dry land. Doing pretty good, how are you today? I'm pretty good, thank you. I'm pretty good. Experience my Polyrath. Caught one yet? Yes, I have Callum. I've I've just caught quite a few actually. Just remember the Pokemon trivia thing asked which way the swirly thing goes in the polywag line. What? What kind of Pokemon trivia is that? Um, next up to evolve. I think we're good. I still do need. Yeah, I'm waiting waiting for Zapinator to evolve. Yeah, we're good for now. I could. What I could do is I could quickly catch another. Timber. And uh, we can level that one up to evolve. Oh, it's like one of the break time segments. I see. 
Did you have the same problem I had when the DLC dropped? I had to reboot my Switch in order for it to download. Uh, no, what I do is if you hit the, hit the home button, you can then press the plus button on the software. And you can do an update here, software update via the internet. You can force it that one, uh, that way. I didn't have to do it, uh, reboot mine, I just manually did it, yeah. Nice, I know Callum, I know. Hey Callum, did you see the announcements for the, um, for the Nintendo Direct? What was the one thing I saw that I thought would really pee off Callum? Was it Tomb Raider? It might have been Tomb Raider. Hey Pastel, what should we call this timber? I'm gonna evolve it into a girder. No CK, I'm not going to call it CK. Ow. I was watching CK stream and saw how he downloaded it. Ah. I bet that took him a minute to download as well. Polygon boobs upset him. <laughs> oh. I don't know, there were a couple of games that kind of caught my... There was that one free-to-play team-based game that looked kind of interesting that's coming out in like the spring you want me to call it ck i hate it here yeah it kind of looked like league of legends but it was on like a hex grid beep beep Alright, time to get this guy evolved as well. We're going all the way up to Vico Vault with this guy. I've seen a couple of Pokemon in the DLC so far that I'm like, I would like to try and put together a competitive team um, and see how it does. But then I just think of Charger Bug and how Hylian is going to want to probably want to battle. That hurts my soul. Displaying exceptional mobility, it weaves between trees and shoots down bird Pokemon with his electromagnetic beam. That's just rude. A battery named CK. How is that fitting? <laughs> CK short for Chuck. It's okay, it just means that Pastel has lost uh, nickname privileges. No, not Unicorn Overlord. That one did look kind of interesting though. You see, you, you you know, this is what you get when, like, sub make me call a grub in baked bean. You know, now sub's kicked out of the cr club. <laughs> Alright, let's get one more timber. Because we need to evolve one all the way up to Conkilda. At least I'm not the only one. <laughs> What do you think of Bandal Tales? Oh, the one where they have to knit their way out of a out of an issue? That was eh. Nickname the Timber Kildor. No. Oh. Gave you bloob and whiskers too. True. Sub did give me did, Sub did give me Sub did give me bloob and whiskers. That's a tongue twister. Right, all of you like like Mikes, you realize you, you've pre pretty much made the shortlist for not nicknaming Pokemon right now as well. <laughs> also, Bactrian, you're close. Not a catch. I should probably try, like. Is that. F Wait, was that. Uh oh. Focus punch. Just had a fist come out of a beam. This one will be all the way evolved up to Conkelder. Yeah. Um. Potentially, <laughs> we'll have to we'll have to see if I can actually kill it or you know catch it. I merely corrected the spelling. All right, Bactrian, you're up. What are we gonna call this timber that will evolve all the way up to Conkelder? Alright, this, this timber is being a particular nuisance right now. K 
kill code. Uh, oh my. Oh dear. Let's try Earth Power. Just get a little bit of damage in there. Right, this is absurd. What should I eat? Alright. I mean, you don't have to, you know, pick a nickname for me if you don't want to. Hungry, but I'm also trying to be smart. Oh, there's the catch. I'm gonna need a nickname, Bactrian. Ramen! Thank you very much for the gifted over to Pastel. Thank you, Ramen. Constructor. Alright then. How many R's? I can only fit two. I'll have to do. Uh, I need to. I need to heal my squad. Thank you, Ramen. Much appreciated. All right, chat. How many of you that played the original Scarlet and Violet have been playing the DLC? And how many of you just don't care for it? Like, if you didn't play the original Scarlet Violet. I don't, I don't really, you know, doesn't really matter, I suppose. How did she get the different clothes that you have on your character? Um, you get it when you buy the DLC. We'll be buying it tonight, hopefully. Have fun, sub. Have fun. I think we have to go... Follow the signs are right. It's kind of cool how the signs are all rusted. Constructor and instructor. To the dreaded den. Danger. Do not enter. Cool. Let's go. I'll probably get back into it again. Did you ever finish the Pokedex, Ramen? I forget. I know that, um... I'm, I'm pretty sure that you finished the game. I'm on the DLC, but I haven't finished the OG game yet. I heard that um, you can play the DLC if you haven't finished the main story, and the whole region does scale based off of how many um, like plot points you've finished. I'm playing it on Scarlet. Look, it's my Coridon. Me alone, Gia, dude. Yeah, I did new hairstyles. Oh, okay. I mean, to find... Like, I found a, a person that sold clothes, and I was like, Ooh, new clothes! It was knitted socks and knitted gloves. He accidentally bought it for Scarlet. Oof. Ouch. Yo, look at this! Oh, this is cool. Do you need more than knitted socks and gloves? I mean, underwear would be useful. Not knitted underwear. Knitted underwear sounds uncomfortable, painful, and a nightmare to clean. And itchy. Yeah. This area's really neat. Oh, we're in, like, the mouth area. I don't want to jump. I could have... I, I have ruined everything. Oh. Oh, no. I'm sorry to hear that you feel like you've ruined everything. It's important to remember that mistakes happen. It's okay to have moments where things don't go as planned. Sounds like your friend wanted to bring some comedic flair to the stream, and that's awesome. Maybe you can chat with them about it and find another way to bring humor to the stream. Don't be too hard on yourself. We all stumble sometimes. Hang in there. Oh, here he is. Apparently there are three in each game, Triven, is what I've heard. I got mine from CD Keys. Yeah. I got mine from CD Keys, and then when you... When you, um, get the code, 
it asks you when you redeem it on the Switch if you want it for Scarlet or Violet. Dazza, did you have trouble getting across that narrow path? Not really. Making Victoria plum jam and the kitchen smells amazing. Victoria plum... See, whenever I hear of Victoria plum, I just think of the bathroom suppliers. <laughs> there it is. The dreaded den. This is supposed to be the ogre's home. At least that's what I've, everyone says. Can't remember the time, but I've never seen it. Yeah, no worries, Ramen. Thanks for hanging out, and thanks for the gifted to Pastel again. Much appreciated. Thank you. Maybe a powerful ogre like that would only show up here if it had some kind of battle going on. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, I think I got a bit stronger since last time we battled, so, you know, if you wanted to, we could battle. Sure. I'm gonna die. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, he's gonna heal me. Okay, that's nice. I just spent all of my healing items on healing my team, but okay. Hey, Delaray! I give it a go. I got uh, what I get. I, yeah, I, I I got this. Furt. Dead bird. Uh, Tokyo Chan, honestly, I hate my hair. But this guy and his sister. Oh, that's a spoon. Uh, Yanma? Um, this could be a problem. Uh, but this guy and his sister both have like this weird crisscross fringe in front of the nose. It's just so bizarre. Bounce! <gasps> Boiling. Dead. Bye, Ramen! <laughs> Polywell. I don't have anything else other than Mian Chao. I'm just gonna go for a Drain Punch again. Just hope we get some of that health back. Come on, Polywell, charge at him with everything you've got. It's not fast than me, is it? Oh! Right. This could be a problem. All right, CK, you're up. Just focus punch. Just in case it does something stupid like belly drum. Oh, it used haze. Okay. I mean, we, we get off a focus punch, which is good. Schmack! That was a 150 base power fighting type move. Do it again! Oh yeah, I've got two. I've got two back trim. Uh oh! Yeah, this is CK. He's dead. We're still gonna go for that focus punch. Oh, rip. Well, CK's dead. <laughs> the Vika Vault wasn't named after him? No, I don't think it was. Yeah, there's Constructor. On the inside, sad. <laughs> What's up, Chuckabo Wing? How you doing? Uh, do we try this again with Constructor? Just keep trying with the folk. Well, I, I know we can, we can survive one hit. I think, as the other one did. Yeah, so let's, let's not bother with a... A focus punch. Let's just smack it with superpower. The battery should have been named after him. I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm so I'm lost, Bactrian. I'm so lost. 
Oh man, I lost. Zappinator. Oh, that was ages ago. We we called him Zappinator yesterday. <gasps> Quacky Chan's evolving. Ah, oh, they grow up so fast. Swanna. I thought you were the Bactrian Whisperer. I, I, I don't understand a thing you say, Bactrian. Swinging wood around. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye, Robin. Sends around its leader, the flock dances in perfect sync to strengthen its unity. Ching. Why are they so late in the Pokedex? Blue Bressier. Alright, that is Polly, so Polly's going to remain as a Poliwhirl, and Bubbles is going to be our Politoad. So I'm going to have to do a trade evolve at some point. Why are we so close to it? <laughs> I'm going to have to do a trade evolve for that at some point, and for Conkeldur. But I'm going to wait and see how many other trade evolutions we have to do. I knew it. You really are strong, Dazza. How am I ever going to beat you? The Ogre saw that battle. I'm sure it'd be thinking, that kid's got real strength. See my school, Blueberry Academy? It's a school that specializes in teaching the art of Pokemon battling. Uh, if I if I was as strong as you, maybe I could aim to be the best trainer there. Let's go have a look in the Ogre's Den. Alright then, what could possibly go wrong? I am living Dexon, yeah. <gasps> Feet. We are a champion, it's true. Watch your head. On your left. See how dark it is in here? And cramped? Even the floors are rough and uneven. But it's a cave. Living all alone in a place like this would get pretty miserable, don't you think? Poor Ogre. We have plenty of room at our house. I totally let it stay with us. When can I move in? I don't know if we'd have room for both of you, Dazza. But if the ogre really did show up to stay at our place, I'm sure the whole town would freak. Loud thunk. You pop your head again, Lily, on the cave ceiling. Well, no way, the sun's already gone down. Guess we'll have to save the last signboard for tomorrow. Tomero. The DLC mons are already causing major drama in the BGC. BTW. <laughs> Are there any that we've seen that are an example of that? I almost forgot. Today's the first day of the Festival of Masks over at Kitakami Hall. It's this big event where everybody puts on masks and runs around celebrating. I mean, it's not like you've got to go or anything, but if you wanted to, you know, check it out, well, it'll be fun. It does sound fun. I, um, can show you to it. It'd be great to go together. The leg end dairies are already in there. Oh, interesting. Uh, well, the the monkey dory, okie dogie, pheasant dippity. Just a few things we'd have to get ready first, so we should swing by my house before heading to the festival. I heard the base stats for those aren't that great, though. Yo, what's up, Kristen? Welcome back. We live in the northwest corner of the village. So, uh, let's see. Maybe I could draw a map. Oh, your rotor phone has a map in it, huh? Yeah, geeky. It's difficult, isn't it? Would you register it on your map? Yeah, I could give that a try. Boop. Wowzers, it sure is handy having a map that shows everything right there in your phone. Gonna ask if I can get a Rotom phone someday too. I'll be right behind you if you want to head to my family's place first. See you there. This kid just keeps following me at a distance. It's kind of creepy. A DLC day was yesterday. Um, yeah. We, we got access to DLC yesterday. I'm going through so many revives. <laughs> yeah, he gets to where you're going before you. Oh, yeah. Weird. But actually make a phone call. It's true. It's very true. I 
Okay. Uh, let's grab Wendy. Get Jan Mega back. Why not? This is kind of like the team that I'm working with at the moment. Part of me wants to use Polyrath, but I already have a water type and a fighting type. No. Maybe Patuti? Bug and Ferry? We've already got a bug type. Alright, for the time being, it'll just be this. I don't think there's any other Pokemon I need to evolve that I've got stored away. Um, but we can grab some others on the way if we see more Clefairies. Oh, I wonder if we'll see Wild Cleffer. Or if we're going to have to breed it. Prism Scale! So somewhere around is going to be a Feebas. It's probably going to be... Wrong button. Wrong, <laughs> Wrong button. Oh, Ganondorf's Queen! Well, hello! And, and now your name makes sense, because you're back. <laughs> um, maybe over here, you get Feebas. Okay, where are we actually going? Oh, okay. Right at the back there. Cool. Uh, I'm gonna head down. I'm gonna walk though. Well, I'm gonna ride Coridon. Imagine making a phone call, right? Just in case we see a Pokemon that we haven't seen yet. Uh, I do need more Geodudes. Right, because I've only got the one. I need two more. going to eat breakfast. Love breakfast. Breakfast is so good. I don't know what I should eat this evening, though. Alright, Geodude. Here's the shtick. You're going to get in this timer board and you're going to stay in there. Thank you. Triven, what are we going to call this Geodude? It's going to be a Graveler. Breakfast for dinner does sound good. I don't have... I don't have all the stuff for it, though. Toph. Okay. <laughs> Bad to the party. We do need one more. I'm going to get one on the way down, though. Like that one right there. Actually, you know what? Let's get this Terrestrial one. Because it'll automatically get down to the right amount of health. And I'm going to let chat as a collective name this one. This is going to be our golem. Oh, that's not good. This is going to be our golem. What are we going to call it? Marvin? Marvin's a good name for a golem. It's a female, though. Meatball. No, I'm, yeah, I mean, I, I only know the streamer called Toph. I'm sorry. That's gonna hurt. I didn't hurt that much, actually. Oh, rip. Mary? Uh, let's just drain punch. Hope we, um... We don't get confused. Alright. Very good. Spend way too much time on this site, by the way. Me too. I think we're just gonna call it Meatball. Jade. Okay, no, that's a good one because it's a rock. I like I like Jade. Meatball nearly got it though, Pastel. No redemption arc for you just yet. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, from what I've heard, Mary's actually quite contrary. <laughs> One day, I'll be allowed to suggest nicknames again. This is where I came from, isn't it? There's a dum dum. Tandem mouse. I've not seen any other normal types up here.
Oh, that took me a second. <laughs> Bactrian. <laughs> that took me a second. But good job. Prefer Marie to Mary. I used to know someone called Marie. She was cool. Um, she used to work at the Tesco for a long time. I haven't seen her for a couple of years now, though. Maybe she, um... Because she, like, she got a job there pretty much straight out of school. And then just, you know, rose up. You know, towards managerial level. I don't see her around anymore. Maybe she's moved on to different pastures. I've never known a Mary, though. I feel like Mary is a bit of more of an old-fashioned name than Marie. Luke. Is he shiny? Not shiny Pokemon. That would be nice, though. Shiny. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's too many Pokemon around here that... ...that we don't have. It actually doesn't look like there's too many Pokemon around here, to be honest. Yeah, Mez, that would be nice. Um, you know what I have noticed, though? The DLC area, like Kitakami and the town specifically, does feel a lot more alive and a lot more lived in. Like. There's actually a decent number of people around. Which is nice. Hey, whoop has gone for a swim. Her name was Veronica. Her, her name is Veronica and she couldn't say it properly so she called it Mary. I'm going to drop a save here, just because everything's going really slow. I don't want to live here? Yeah. It's little things like, you know, putting rust textures on signposts. But it's just the fact that there's just, like, way more people around. It feels like this is an area that people actually live in. And they added more trees as well. I mean, look! I think in this picture right here, we can see more trees than there are in Paldea. <laughs> What's up, Tractor Head? How we doing? Should we go get a spoiler for a Pokemon that's in the DLC? Carbink! Already? Classic Carbink. To be fair though, Carbink was actually included... Like, it was a transfer Pokemon. Um... In the, the, the patch before this one. The Pokemon Home patch. Pressure canned French fries. What's the air fry? Pressure... Pressure canned air fries. Uh, French fries. Oh, look at this big pokey rock. The Mossend Boulder. They said long ago this mass of rock fell from the sky into Mosui Town. It was feared that the ogre on the mountain threw the boulder to wreak havoc on the village. It's now understood to be a fragment of the Fallen Horn, one of the six wonders of Kitakami. Oh! There's a horn up there that I should have interacted with. What do you mean I can't get on? I want to get the item. Oh, never write them. Can I climb on the tent? No. Oh, I see, tractor, I see. Oh, sorry. I got the yawnsies. I, I tried to sleep for a long amount of time. Um, 
But I had to get up at like 7. Oh, we're going off road. Vulpix! Bronzor. Venoshock. Trivago. If it landed there from the upheaval. <laughs> oh man, I'm like, I'm so out of the loop with Zelda now. I don't think I can get back into that game. It's been so long. I see a cave. I see a cave. I see multiple caves. We're off roading now. Skippity doo. It's just it's just been a long time. It's been like two months now. Cleffa and Hoot Hoot <gasps> Hoot 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 I I I, I do want to do more Zelda. Don't get me wrong. I want to find out how the story ends and stuff like that. But like you know. It's been a minute. Um, we've currently got Pokemon DLC, we've got Palea, um, Pikmin 1 and 2, physical launches sometime later this month. Uh, someone gifted me uh, Super Mario RPG, we've got Mario Wonder coming out. There's a lot of games coming out at the end of this year to stream. Exactly, CC, yeah. That's crazy, sub. Alright, Cece, we need a name for the Cleffa. We're gonna call the little baby Clefairy. On late nights, illuminated by shooting stars, it gazes intently skyward, as if thinking of its home. Ah. Baldur's Gate 3 and Fey Farm. I don't know if Baldur's Gate is one of those f series that I would get into if I started playing it. Male or female, it is a lady. Lady Cleffa. Yeah, I mean, now with, like, my weekend job, and just lower en energies in general. I've just got less time to stream as well. So it's really difficult to fit everything in that I want to do. Now this one will remain a cleffer. Cat after my niece. Okie dokie. But we do need to catch another Clefairy to evolve into Clefable. So let's do that right now. This is why I need to be retired already. Are you close, sub? I don't mean like age-wise, I mean like monetarily-wise. Age-wise would be very rude of me to assume. That's not a catch. Clefairy mass outbreak in a couple of weeks. Wait, what? That's not a catch either. Alright chat, we need a name for a Clefable. A female Clefable. Pokemon Go event? Oh, I didn't know there was one on Pokemon Go. Give it 20 years or so. Oof. If it makes you feel any better, I'm definitely nowhere near retirement. My, my savings are negative. Moon. You and your youth. Luna. That's a classic, isn't it? It's pretty good. I like it. Celine. I like Celine. We're gonna go for we're gonna go for Luna. Ursa Luna, wrong game. I'd like to retire. <laughs> Looney. Let's grab ourselves a loon stone. So chat, with my uh, Pokedex tracker, I have 
I've been updating the code to include like a teal mask toggle. Um, but I haven't obviously added any of the data into it just yet because I don't know the Pokemon that's in it. But also, I broke the tracker. So, I have to fix that. It's still like, the one that's online is still working. Don't worry, that one's fine. Um, yeah, no, that one's still working for like the base game. Look at all these hoot hoots! This should just be an easy catch, right? There's absolutely no reason why we can't just catch a hoot hoot in a ultra ball immediately. Di uh, direct from Pokemon and the Clefairy thing. Uh, one second. Yes, you may. As long as you do it in the next 60 seconds. Yes, I did, Kristen. I did. Kristen, what are we going to call this Hoot Hoot? It's a lady Hoot Hoot. We need a nickname for it. Mass Outbreaks. Mass Outbreaks are a phenomenon in which many of the same species of Pokemon appear in one location. After the release of the Hidden Treasure Area Zero Part 1, the Teal Mask for Pokemon Scarlet or Violet limited time mass outbreaks event will begin during those events certain pokemon will begin become more likely to appear in mass outbreaks okay locations paldea and kitakami interesting oh he's got marks Wait. Oh, the upbeat mark. Oh, that is cool. I like that. Uh, we'll go with Lumine, because we literally just called a uh, Clefairy Lum Luna. <laughs> Lumine. Cool. Thank you, Tractor Head. Oh. Ragsire. Do the thing. Alright, let's get ourselves a Noctowl. Similar meaning, so it works. All I can think of is, um, the character in Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. That was close to, but not called Lumine. Or maybe she was. Um... All right, DJ Artemis, do you want to do you want to pick a name for for our Noctowl? Lusamine. Yeah, that was yeah, that was it. Brewster. Brewster's pretty good. I'm going to have to yoink that one actually. We'll have to let we'll have to let Artemis pick the next one. Nah, it's okay. Artemis, don't worry about it. <laughs> you, you can pick the next one, but get, get your thinking hat on. I'm gonna be picking you randomly out of the crowd. Brewster, yes! <laughs> Excellent suggestion, Artemis. <laughs> right, let's get Wendy back out there. Or if you don't want a nickname a Pokemon, don't worry about it. You can say pass. And, uh... I just think it's funny to put people on the spot with Pokemon nicknames. Doodly doo. There was another cave around here somewhere, wasn't there? That's the one I just jumped from. Wisp. The fact that Brewster isn't a rooster, though. Chat, 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 chat. Guess what arrived the other day? I haven't opened it yet. Look! Ready for some ASMR opening? Comes in a little metal can. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Okay. Interesting. But yeah, they're little, uh... They're little roost coasters. There's four of them. Clean with a damp cloth and wipe dry. Do not place in the dishwasher. The coasters are heat resistant to 90 degrees C, but they are not heat proof. Do not use with extremely hot or cold items. Take extra care when using on a polished surface. They've got like an anti-slip bottom to them. But... No, they don't. <laughs> They're actually really bad. <laughs> They're cute, though. Bot Bound, tell us a joke. Did you hear about the chameleon who couldn't change color? They had a, a, a reptile dysfunction. We've had that one before. That is my favorite Bot Bound joke we've ever had. It was my favorite Bot Bound joke ever. Is that Hound Hour? Hey, buddy. Still mad I can't get the coast because uh, stupid not shipping to Sweden. Yeah. It's a shame. But they're cute. I like them. They're all right. Well, these are like... They remind me of a... Like a pin badge. Not like... It seems like really... Really cheaply made metal. And then they don't have cork on the bottom, but some kind of... I'm guessing heat-resistant synthetic rubber type thing, but the the bottom doesn't like the the inside. <gasps> Chingling, the inside rubber heat-resistant bit doesn't stick out below the coaster. Chingling, he's so cute. Chat, I need an opinion. I can give you one. Pokemon Legends Arceus was a terrible game. He used Yawn. What? Who's making all that racket over there? Hey there, it looks like you're talking about wanting to judge or bash someone. Remember, it's always important to treat others with kindness and respect. Instead of focusing on that judgement, how about we celebrate people's strengths and positives? Let's spread positivity and lift each other up. Legends Arceus was still a trash game. Bash <laughs> Yeah, Neo! <laughs> Bro is moving back home, and back in with parents, he has furniture, he's probably going to end up being stored at my house more than likely. Should I change? Uh, should I charge a storage fee? If so, how much? No. Alright, Artemis, if you're still here, we need a nickname for Chingling. As long as I think you're up front and, like, look, if this furniture isn't gone after a month or so, lemon, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> There's an orb inside its mouth. When it hops, the orb bounces all over, making a ringing sound. Little lemon. Adorable. Thank you, Artemis. You named your first whooper Dazza. Thank you, Kristen. Oh. Suddenly, Hound Hour. Leave me alone. Thank you very much. I'm asleep. These guys are zooming. Here's money saved up for down payment on a house. Oh, yikes. Um, I mean, if it's going to be a while... It depends how much he's got, really. But if he's saving up for a down payment on a house, tell him to sell the furniture. Like, if it's going to be that long, that's crazy. Good luck, Delray. Thanks for popping in. Appreciate it. Have a good one. Good luck. Alright, where was I going again? I was meant to be going to that person's house.
Oh yeah, they're like setting up the area. And you done. I hear a before I heard a chime echo. I want another chingling. I want a chime echo. Why are we h -des browsing? Oh, there's a the chime echo. Hi. Festival area feels sad. Why does it feel sad? Seems pretty cool to me. They're still setting it up in my... Well, I don't know. You're, you're further ahead than me, aren't you? Oh, for Bruce to knock out. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I do need one more. Is that shiny? That's not shiny, is it? Oh. I do need one more Nuzleaf, I think, so that I can evolve into Shifri. Yeah, it really depends on how much and how long it's for. Um, but if if the plan is to that's a phantom if the plan is to wait until he's got enough for a down payment on a house that's a long time for you to store his furniture it also depends on how much you like him Phantom! Lily, what are we going to call the Phantom? Mainly the how much you like him, yeah. We got two of his twigs. Which sounds a bit mean. Legend tells that its green leaves can cure any illness. When plucked, however, the leaf will instantly wither away. Oh. It's a boy. Phantom. He gets paid 18 something now and is looking for a job in town, either something for the same pay or more, plus he does DoorDash on the side and pays, leave 800 for rent where he is now. I know mom and dad will only be charging 150 for rent at their house, so he'll have plenty of money left over for the down payment, he won't have bills, so I honestly don't see why I shouldn't ask for some money for his stuff living in my house. Yeah, especially if it's going to take up some of your room. And if he doesn't like it, tell him he can pay more for a storage locker. Stumpy if you want tree jokes. <laughs> oh, this is cool. I don't remember seeing this before. Oh, I got a phantom. I forget. How do you get Trevenant? Trevenant is a trade evolution, isn't it? Another one. Okay, I know I'm meant to be going back to town, but I want to go back over that river and get myself another Shiftry. Not Shiftry, Nuzleaf. For a Shiftry. Trade Evo. Thank you, thank you. And again, I don't think I went into this field before. You looking for Shiftry? No, no, I'm looking for, um... Well, I want to get a shift re because I don't have one yet for the decks. But I know where I found a Nuzleaf before, so I'm going to go over to there, get another one. <laughs> Good old Bob Bound. Absolutely. Wow, he's positive today, isn't he? Oh, good. I guess I could now let Bob Bound use the, um... The new Tier 3 emotes. Since he is, like, a permanent Tier 3 sub. What? What's that? Daz has got new Tier 3 emotes? What? Yeah, right? Crazy. No, 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 it's, it's all good. I, yeah. <laughs> I appreciate that, Bactrin. I, I did know what you were talking about, though, because I did catch a, a Twitter leak. Because apparently a bunch of people were talking about it. The fact that it's uh, Shiftry's in the game and its uh, ability has changed to Wind Rider. Hello, hello, Dazza. Looks like you caught 147 kinds of Pokemon that can be found around the lands of Kitakami. If 
you head up high in Oni Mountain, you'll find volcanic gas leaking out of the ground. Sounds like a comfy place for Pokemon that are drawn to that sort of thing, doesn't it? You should make note not to inhale too much of that gas yourself, Dazza. Why? It sounds like fun. Are we Masuda-ing a regional variant or too soon? Prepares for eggs. What, Shifri? You could go check out that place that has deadly gas accumulates naturally. That'd be fun, trust me. Yeah, just don't breathe. I'm already filled with natural gas. Yeah, I'm full of hot air. Oh, that's Illumise! I was like, what is that? It's flying above the water. It's Illumise! Cool! Stinky. Uh-oh! We should be fine with a Drain Punch, right? There's loads of them around here. Yank is very easy. I'll probably wait till Saturday when he comes from his weekly visit from Dad at home to back me up. Oh, that sound. I hate it so much. Oh. Alright, this thing's going in a netball. Just because it probably will just catch straight away. Alright, chat. Joint effort time. Nickname for Illumise. Should we go with, like, a classic Romeo and Juliet? Because I'm imagining this means Volbeat's around here somewhere as well. Frank. Hello, Tudor. Illumise uses its sweet scent to guide Volbeat, having them form over 200 patterns in the night sky. Bugsy. Mario. This is Illumise. These would all be... Okay, we're gonna call it Tudor. What a great suggestion. Thanks, Lily. That was two Frankies in a row. Is it because I bug you? Absolutely. Yep. No, it was a suggestion by Lily. I thought, what a great name for an Illumise. Ouch. Hey, don't don't ask a question that you're not, uh, you know, you're not prepared for the answer for. Suskit Masquerain. Wait, we never evolved. We never got gel, did we? Where's gel? I need gel back. There you are. Oh, I guess we have to wait now until these have leveled up a bit. Weren't these version exclusive in X and Y? Volbeat and Illumise typically are version exclusive. Typically are version exclusives, I think. So maybe they might be version exclusives this time around as well. There's just a house chilling here. There's another leaf. He ya No no not not antibacterial, antibacterian gel. Oh, drain punch is super effective? Because it's dark type, right? That won't kill it though, will it? Oh, okay, never mind. This one house is an introvert's dream. I mean, yeah, this is actually a, like, I would love to live here. Just like, you know, out in the middle of nowhere, you got trees just hanging. You know, near the river, close enough to town to go for a walk to go get stuff. That's a Volbeat. One of these days, I won't get distracted. Netball. Alright, so our first... Our Illumise was called Tudor. So what are we going to call our Volbeat? But today is not that... Ooh, what's that over there? Mm-hmm, I know. Sloth. Lily. <laughs> Lily. 
I mean, it has to be sloth, doesn't it? Why does that sound so loud? Why does it have to be so loud? Yeah, yeet. I'm so special. I mean, not everyone has a, you know, the username split over two Pokemon. It lives around clean ponds. At night, its rear lights up. It converses with others by flashing its light. All right, so you've got a, a light up behind and you flash. You got anything to tell us, Tudor Sloth? I have a flashy bomb. Maybe you shouldn't. Constructor is evolving. I don't have a way to long store my potatoes after pulling them, so the relative did this and sent them to me for me to try. He gets doing it this afternoon now with some, some of ours. Nice. They strengthen their bodies by carrying steel beams. Show off their big muscles to their friends. Oh my god. Gerda is a gym chad. How else do I attract a mate? Has it worked for you so far? Just no, flashing your bum. All right, trade evolve. Uh, what else is a trade evolve? A uh, graveler that we don't have yet. Bum flashing does work. Can confirm that was too much information. Tudor is a firefly. Oh, Politoed. Just the wrong kind. <laughs> yeah, probably. I don't think anything else here evolves with trading. Yet. Like I said, we've got um, Jade, the will, once it's evolved once. Quite a few. Oh, and we need another Phantom. Quite a few Pokemon around here, though. Pretty good. All right, now what's this hoose? There's a trainer here. That little hut. All right, let's see what you've got to say about the little hut after we fight. Little hut's so weird. No one's ever there. Oh, okay. What's up, Bactrian? Kazuhiro, the office worker. Did you go to the little house over there? I'm trying to go to the little house over there. I keep getting distracted. This could be bad. It's a nice house. Just say it. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go check it out. Don't worry. I'm gonna go look. I still haven't got my. Um... Oh, okay. I still haven't got my Nuzleaf that I came here for. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Greedent. Uh, I'll stay with Mian Chao, but the only fighting move I have now is high jump kick. So you better not miss Whiskers. Okay. Good. Oh, okay. Well, we're gonna have to try that again. Oh! Never mind. We're dead. This could be a problem. All right, CK. It's your turn again. Superpower. Quicker than a Greedent. Oh, I didn't put gel in my squad. Good for CK. <laughs> At least there's nobody around to see me lose. Wait, did CK... I didn't see CK level up. That's weird. Alright, we're gonna keep Girder as he is. I need to sort through all these boxes and, like, organize them. Alright, Gel, you're back. 
Do we have any other Pokemon here that we could evolve through level up? Don't think we do. Alright, we're literally right next to the house. Let's not get distracted. 